Hello, hello, hello. Patricia here, Stampin' Up! demonstrator in the United States, but more specifically here in Alaska. And, <coughs> excuse me, today I'm going to do a, or try to do, a quick review of the items that I have in the catalog. Some I know I have and I can't find. I might have left in the village. But anyway, besides that, uh, I cannot open the catalogs yet until January 4th when they go live. If you do not have your catalog, especially if you live here um, near Anchorage or the Valley uh, and you would like a catalog, please let me know. I will get that to you. Uh, we can meet somewhere, whatever. I can mail it, whatever works for you. Um, if you do not already have a demonstrator, if you have a demonstrator, obviously you want to get your catalog from them. But I am going to go through these very quickly. I know you're seeing this map behind me. I will get to that, but not quite yet. It's a kind of a little sneak peek. This is the first item I am going to look at. And I don't even have everything because I noticed when I got here that I left the punch for this in the village. <clears throat> I know, but when you travel back and forth from two different homes, that kind of thing happens. Anyway, it is a gorgeous stamp set. I absolutely love it. It creates this little bumblebee. These are the wings. These are the background for it. So, I mean, just gorgeous. Some faces, some antlers. It's flying along. Uh, be mine. I love you no matter what. Love that one. You're as sweet as honey. You'll always be the one for me. You make my heart buzz and happy Valentine's and love you. Absolutely love that. The papers in here are just fantastic. I've gone through quite a, <laughs> quite a little bit of this and I think this might even be my second packet. Um, but anyway, love it. The hearts, the little bees, the flowers on the back. I think that one's already there. This one, <coughs> excuse me, the stripes, flowers, and then more bees with flowers. Beautiful, beautiful paper. Love that. I should have had the cards that I've already made from that, but I don't, so I don't. <laughs> That's the way it goes, right? All right, this next one, another absolutely gorgeous set and uh, first of all this is the the ribbon in it it's kind of got a metallic -y feel to it but it's gorgeous and it it uh, creates a bow very nicely I love this if I can hold it and do it while I'm on screen right come on come out of there there we go Whoops, back of it. There we go. Gorgeous bow. Very nice. I won't cut it right now. Um, lifetime of love. <clears throat> love this. Wishing you a lifetime of love and happiness forever and always. Congratulations on your wedding day. Love you. A beautiful wedding set. Although it doesn't have to be wedding. I mean, it could be anniversary. Um, the dies in here are amazing. Look at that. Even if you only got it for that, how beautiful. This way, that way, whichever, you know, would work for you. Um, love this one as well, the circle with the leaves on the edge. And then, of course, cutting out the pieces, parts and pieces, don't you know? And then I love this paper, this cardstock. <clears throat> the cardstock, it's both sides so you could even cut this and make more fronts of cards i mean it's gorgeous or and or uh, you've got this envelope with the gorgeous cutout on it absolutely love that you will want to be sure you glue down this portion i think yeah it has a portion here but i would glue down that edge so that it doesn't get caught up in the mail <clears throat> Beautiful, beautiful paper uh, cardstock. And then this is in with this sweet, this gorgeous pillow box. And it's already got tape on it, so you just pull that apart. Isn't that gorgeous? I love it. I'm going to stamp this before I um, 
put it together, so I don't want to tape it, but it's a beautiful little pillow. These are the pink, uh, Petal Pink and Pretty Peacock Foil Gems. I don't know if you can see it, but it almost looks very Alaskan. It almost is jade with gold in it. Isn't that beautiful? And then, of course, the Petal Pink as well, but looks very Alaskan to me. And then the paper here, which I have not even opened. I have literally just barely gotten home unpacked all my stuff, including the new boxes that I had when I got home. So I haven't had a whole lot of time. This one, gorgeous. And then look at all this gold foil. Wow. Back. That's beautiful. And stripes. Some of these would be fantastic folded backwards. Oh, like that one. Isn't that gorgeous? Wow. Love it. Lots of pretty peacock in here. That one. And that one. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. I'm trying to go fast. So that's why I'm kind of rushing here. Because... Uh, I haven't been able to do a video in forever because of camera and battery and uh, you name it, problems. So I'm going to try to go fast here. And I'm trying to go with what I have or what I managed to bring back with me. <laughs> This is a brayer. This is new to us. We haven't had this in a long time. I'm so thrilled that we have it because I use a brayer in my own stamping often, but I haven't dared to, to do anything with it because we didn't have one. Um, another thing, I'll, sh I'll just do a whole video on the brayer uh, pretty soon. It's gorgeous for doing... Well, I'll go through that later. But it also has the little stand built in. This side, you you put your ink down. This side, it sits up on your table so that it doesn't get ink everywhere. This is the Adoring Hearts to my Valentine. Loved celebrating you with all my heart. I adore you just for you. Oh, you must be loved. <laughs> there we go. And with all my heart. Um, but then there is this which is one of those hybrid embossing folders. Hello, how do you, oh, I'm trying to open it on the wrong end. Okay, and it's gorgeous. So, get it open. Okay, there's two different parts to it. There is the, the embossing folder itself. So let's get rid of all of this. There we go. How gorgeous. Can you see that? Maybe it was better without that. Anyway, the hearts on here. And then it can cut those hearts as well. I know I should have opened all of this, but I was too excited. Okay. So then this comes out. And... It can cut as one big piece, and it actually helps you guys see what's there by me pulling this off. Okay, all the little parts and pieces that you can do for the inside, and then this, as with all the um, hybrid in, uh, embossing folders, hybrid and die cutting, you put that in there, you put your ink on it, and then cut it. And gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I cannot wait to play with this. And then all these little bits and pieces on the inside. I'm presuming it's going to cut out some of these. I'll have to play with that and see. So we'll, we'll do more of that later. But gorgeous set. Let me get everything out of the way. Love this. So excited that we've got a hybrid. I mean that we <coughs> have a um, brayer. And I know you can hear that. It's clicking on the um, 
board, but we'll get to that in a minute. Okay, this is another one of those builder sets that you've got the skies and the hills and different pieces and houses and trees and wishing you peace. Hello, you're in my thoughts. I just can't thank you enough. Cannot wait to play with this. I love these scene builder stamp sets. Here's another one. Now this one and one of the others, I'll show you it as soon as I can find it, is um, one of these that is going to be fantastic for um, like junk journaling or creating your own DSP. Uh, here's to new beginnings. You're greatly appreciated. Heartfelt condolences. Thank you. Wishing you well today, tomorrow, and every day that follows. And then... Again, I haven't had a chance to use any of these. I love the fern. This looks like a fiddlehead fern, which we get here in Alaska in the spring. So that'll be fun to play with. And then here are the dies that go with that. Woohoo! One already came out. Um, this, I love these corner pieces. This was why I ordered this set in particular, but I love all of it. And then cutting out the different pieces, and then there's also some labels. Just fantastic. I cannot wait. This probably will be one of the first ones I play with, because I just love that. I know, I probably say that on all of them, but it really is true. <laughs> It'll be the first one that I play with after the first one that I put Now, you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, let's get the next one. Now, this one was the one that I was my very, very first just loved out of this uh, um, mini catalog. This is butterflies that are already die cut for you and I think they call them laser cut or something like that but look at that isn't that just gorgeous and there's several pages in here does it tell you how many bee um, how many bees 40 there are 40 butterflies you know those are bees right <laughs> and the um, purple fine shimmer gems goodness haven't gotten all the names down, but I love the purple in here. Okay, this includes two different, this suite, I should say, includes two different um, stamps and die bundles. So this one is all your sentiments, and this one is all your flowers. These are going to be gorgeous. These look very Alaskan to me as well, being the... Uh, Shoot, all I can think of is forget-me-nots, but it's a fireweed. It looks like fireweed to me. And there are dies for this. Love this postage stamp die. And perennial postage. Um, here for you always. Thank you for your friendship. You are loved beyond measure. You're simply marvelous. I can't thank you enough. Big hugs. You mean the world to me. Happy Mother's Day. Sending love and best wishes. I know you will get through this. These are some of the best, just general card sentiments. I love them. Love them, love them. Um, this one, Painted Lavender, which is going to go with this paper here in just a moment. We'll see. Here are the dies that cut out, I believe it is all of the... <laughs> this one looks like a giraffe. Um, cut out all of the stamps. So that's pretty awesome. Love that. Painted lavender. Okay, and then this is the designer series paper. So let's open this up. Haven't even had a chance to open it, as you can see. Okay, whoops, sorry about that. All right. Beautiful. Oops, sorry about that. Sorry, sorry. Well, all right. Only have two hands, right? I love the colors of this purple. Beautiful. These, I know they are probably um, 
shoot, I forgot, uh, Queen Anne's Lace, but they look like what we have up here called, um, oh, that is so beautiful. I'm trying to think, what's that called? It's not Queen Anne's Lace that we have in Alaska. It is, can't think of it. Ah! <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous paper. Oh, my goodness. Whoops. I pulled up three rather than two. Oh, love the hound's tooth with dots in it. That's gorgeous. This one, whoops, is the back of this one. I love these. There are flowers in there, but they look very much like... Um, Oh, uh, what's it called? Oh my goodness, my words are escaping me today. Wow, isn't that beautiful? Oh, so much color. Love it. Okay, the colors in this one are Berry Burst, Blackberry Bliss, Fresh Freesia, Gorgeous Grape, Highland Heather, Lost Lagoon, Orchid Oasis, Pretty Peacock, Shaded Spruce, and Starry Sky. Huh, I don't know that I saw any Starry Sky, but I'm sure it's in there. Gorgeous, gorgeous paper. Okay, next one. Here we go. Ice cream swirls. This is going to be such a fun set to work with. These are the dies. And notice that this one cuts out a whole card. Now, you can make it, a, put it on the front of your card and make it flip up. Or it could be the whole card itself. Kids would love that. And then the ice cream for on the top. Um, you could, I saw one of these recently where I think they used five different colors. So cut five different sets of these and then just mix them all up. Beautiful swirled ice cream. And then a cup and strawberry and all the piece, uh, you know, sprinkles to go on top. The straw. A donut, there's the strawberry, a cherry. Make a wish, thanks for everything. Hope your day is sweet. Gorgeous card. Now, um, it seems like I had more to that set, but I'm not seeing it. Um, this one, I know I ordered all of this and I can't seem to find it. This is another one of those sweets that has two uh, stamp and die sets, and for whatever reason, I don't seem to have the second one, but we'll look at what we've got. Notes of nature. Today is all about you. Happy birthday. Just a little note. Say hello. Thanks for making me smile. Some great stamps for using fillers. Again, if you're making your own designer series paper, there's also this die which is fantastic. It creates a little dotted thing here that you can fold. So if you want to make it uh, something that's a tear off or, you know, you could use, I can see that being used for a lot of different things. Love this tall greenery piece. Again, these would be gorgeous in um, uh, books, you know, if you want to make those, which I love doing. I'll have to show you me doing some of that sometime. There's a cork What's it called? Adhesive back cork rounds. They're very thin, nicely thin, and are going to be beautiful on a um, card. Now this is, to, it's sort of made, what's it called? Um, forgotten what this is called. Faux leather trim. So it looks like leather. It's not, but it's got a really cool looking, let me get all this off of there. Where's the end of that? There it is right there. Okay, pull that up. It's got a gorgeous, can you see that gold on the front of it? Oh, and the back too. Beautiful. Love that. And, oh yeah, that's going to make a nice bow. Whoop, if you don't pull it too far out. <laughs> there we go. Love it. Okay, papers. Again, let's open this up. 
there are two different DSPs with this because there are, well, not because, but there are, um, but there are two different uh, stamp sets, like I said. I can't show you the other one because I can't find mine. I know it's here somewhere. Just not finding it. Oh, and the swirl. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? I think there's a... Oh, this is the... This is the free one. I was going, this is, this is not with this set, Patricia Diane. This is, I'll show it to you in a minute, but it is one of the free sets that you can get uh, with um, the celebration. So, okay, here we go. This is the paper you get with this set. Sorry about that gorgeous foiling on the fronts of these. I'm just going to give you a little bit of a peek on these just because I'm running way later than I had planned. I wanted to go through this quickly. It's gorgeous paper though. Look at this. This would make six beautiful card fronts. Just cut them up and there you go. Love it. Ooh. And I love the script on this. Can you read that? Well, I won't try right now, but it looks gorgeous. <laughs> I get a little involved, don't I? Okay, then this stack. And we'll look at this real quick. Doggone friendly. Love this. It's a background stamp, so it's all one big stamp. And if you're sending a card to somebody who, say, has a chihuahua, then you can color the chihuahua <laughs> if you want. Or, you know, whatever, a Great Dane, whatever they got, then you can, okay, I've got to find a dachshund. Where's a dachshund? <gasps> Please don't tell me there's no dachshund in there. What? I have a friend who has a dachshund. Oh, here we go. No, that's not a dachshund. Anyway, beautiful. This I've already used a lot. It is a an alphabet die and they're about an inch tall but a a b c d e e f g h h i i you know etc so you but you cut them all at once say you want to do three colors on your card you cut it three times more than likely you've got plenty to say whatever it is you're going to say with just three runs of the anyway love it and then some um, other alphabet characters, some um, periods, exclamations, quotes, you know, all that good stuff. And so, love that. This one, Planted Paradise. I do not know where my die is for this. I just got it. I'll have to look and see if maybe I just, I don't know what happened to it, but it's gorgeous. It's one of those builder sets. Now, and you're not building a scene per se, but you're building pots. Four different pots, um, two different colors, lots of greenery. And so that one's going to be another one that's going to be fun to play with. This one is just too cute, especially for the kids, although I love it in general. You're building a cow. And, oh, here's the cow. <laughs> I was going, wait a minute. Cutest cows. Here's two different faces. Both of those will work for the punch, this one does not, but if you want to do that one, just cut it out. Three different bodies. Um, I believe it's just this body for the punch. Some chicks, a uh, milk can, some flowers, sunflowers, whatever. It's your special day. Thank you. Milk it for all it's worth. Congratulations. Holy cow. The little things you do make such a big difference. And what's moo with you? So... A gorgeous, gorgeous set. I'm going to love doing that. Now, this one, Trusty Tools, is a great dad one. Or, if you have, say, a sister who is very much into tools, um, you know, like maybe me, <laughs> and lots of pieces to cut out. Here's your board, you know, that you hang it on. Uh, you can build a toolbox here with these two. You've got the wrenches, cut that out in silver, um, the tape measure, the paintbrush, and you can cut out, now some of these cut out the handles. Where are they? 
Um, there's different handles that you can, oh, here we go. So you cut out the handle, you cut out the handle. Why am I not seeing them on here? Because I know they're here. Here's the pencil. Where are the handles? I know they're here because I've seen people cut them out. I'm just blind at the moment. So anyway, those are going to be fun. And there's a celebration paper that I'll show you in a few minutes that is gorgeous. Beach, uh, beach Day Dies and Stamp Set. And again, I haven't opened this one, but say if you're uh, in, say, Florida or Georgia, those places where it's nice and warm, you might like this now. <laughs> Not here. Okay, so I've got my little hut, my board. This is the whole hut. Um, umbrella, the beach tree, the uh, palm trees, the ocean, the edge. Uh, oh, it's just gorgeous. Anyway, can't wait to put that together and use it. That's going to be a lot of fun. Wishing you a beautiful day. Happy birthday. Enjoy today. Sending sunshine your way. Somebody needs to send sunshine. My no, it's not that I don't have sunshine. It's just that we have a lot of snow. Stippled roses, gorgeous die set. I mean, a uh, set here, and it does cut out the whole thing. And then you've got some extra leaves and flowers. Happy Mother's Day. That's two Mother's Day ones we've had. Best birthday wish wishes, <laughs> congratulations, and sending thanks. So again, with all of these, I'm going to have to do some so that you can see what they are because they're too much fun. Okay, now. I want to show you the celebration items that you can get free by ordering any of that stuff. Watermelon, watercolor melon. It's funny, I saw somebody reading something the other day and they kept, every time they read it, they didn't read it correctly. I wouldn't be surprised if I do that, so I'm not making fun. <laughs> All right, this one is going to be great, especially in the spring one. Uh, the water, I mean, the the clouds, what's this one called? Uh, sunny Days, and this goes with a stamp and die set that's in the catalog. I don't have it yet, and I believe it cuts out at least the big cloud and maybe some others. I'm not going to go through this because I'm getting way late, um, but I'll show you what's here. Flight and Airy, love this paper. It's gorgeous. Cradled in love. Somebody having a baby. You know, this is stippled roses. So this is the paper, or softly stippled. This is the paper that goes with this stippled roses uh, stamp and die set. So gotta love that. We have some gems in the catalog this time. Love that. It, these are all free items, remember. Heartfelt, hello, Dad, you're the best. Hello, Happy Mother's Day, love you more. Enjoy your day, thinking of you this Easter. So this, all of these, and this one, and the next one, are $50 items, okay? Uh, free with a $50 purchase, is what I'm trying to say. Okay, again, this paper goes with the... Dad, when we looked at this one right here a few minutes ago, okay, this Jungle Pals, how adorable are those? Love it. And this is free, plus, with a $50 purchase, plus this one is free. These are the dies to cut those out with a $100 purchase. So, $150, you get this stamp and die set. For free, $150 purchase. Let's look at these dies. Oh my goodness, lots and lots and lots of stuff. A tree here, the the greenery, lots of greenery cutting out all the animals, more greenery, the sloth, ah, just too cute. So love that, love that, love that. That is going to be a lot of fun to play with. I have two nephews who live next door to me who I'm just going to have to make a card with. And then this is another hundred dollar one, softly sophisticated. The uh, flowers and they build on each other. So you stamp this in green, stamp this or whatever you choose. And then the flowers on top of it. Um, this one I believe goes here. 
Um, so those go together. This goes in between. And then this uh, embossing folder as well goes with this set. So you get an embossing folder. And can you see that? I hope you can. There you go. Maybe on my sleeve. And uh, this die set goes